His prayers for anyone that needs covering over the things the Lord has placed in your life and help managing those things. I ask that you, the listener, are in agreement. Let us pray. Dear Heavenly Father, the listener come to you first and foremost giving you thanks, giving you thanks for who you are in their life. Lord, the listener has been blessed unmeasurably from earthly possessions to blessings that get overlooked daily. Dear Heavenly Father, I pray that the listener is being a good steward in all those things through the purpose you have called the listener to fulfill here on earth. Father, you have placed much responsibility over the listener. If the listener is in good health, have full activity of their limbs, can see or hear that the listener live for you and to utilize all they have to glorify you and manage their blessings responsibly. Dear Heavenly Father, one of the most important things you have given the listener to stewardship is their time. I pray that the listener is utilizing their time to not only make an earthly impact, but to use their blessings to make an eternal impact. Lord, whatever the listener has, you have required them to be a good steward over. And I pray that the listener strives from this day forward to be aware of your blessings and to dedicate their blessings by placing you first. I pray that the listener places you first in time, talent, and resources, including their bodies and mind, by taking care of their temple and exercising self-control by guarding the things that they eat, read, down to the role of exercising and managing their health of their body. Dear Heavenly Father, the listener does not always make the most of everything you have blessed them with including their relationships. But Father, I pray that the listener focus on what you have placed in their lives right now and to be faithful over those things and not to take it for granted. Help the listener to be a good steward and utilizing and managing all resources you, Lord, have provided them for your glory and the betterment of your creation. In 1 Peter 4th chapter 10th verse states, Each of you should use whatever gift you have received to serve others as faithful stewards of God's grace in its various forms. And in Titus 1st chapter 7th verse states, Since an overseer manages God's household, he must be blameless, not overbearing, not quick-tempered, not giving to drunkenness, not violent, not pursuing dishonest gain. So Heavenly Father, whatsoever that the listener has, that you have placed in their possessions, that they have self-control and not allow what you have given the listener to manage, to take control of them. Dear Heavenly Father, place on the listener's heart the areas that have been neglected and help the listener to grow in the area of being more responsible. Lord, I claim that the listener's growth will improve their quality of living, both personally and for you, so that you, Father, can trust the listener with more to manage. And the listener gives you all the glory. In Jesus' name, amen.